Okay, so taking pictures. A lot of people, and I remember when I first started taking pictures, uh, accused me, uh, are you a journalist? I said, who me? No, I'm a blogger. A blogger, so what's that? So they turn around and say, okay, are you allowed? Uh, they're, they're, during the old, way, the old days, so you see an accident, you see something happen, you must phone a nerving employee. You must phone the mainstream media. So that's what people want. It is, a lot of people don't even know what blogger is. So myself, I got this blogger jacket here, and I walk around with, it says blogger. Not, I mean, you gotta be an idiot to walk around with a blogger jacket, but it's for my protection and the cops. They see me, they say, oh, there's the asshole, right there. So, I went through a lot, this used to be brown, and I was charged in, in St. John, and my story was in the New York Times. Go to Google, write New York Times and Charles LeBlanc. You'll see the story. Now, speaking of story, we got all kinds of stories here. So, uh, we got this guy here. Hi. <laughs> You like to talk? You see yeah. you talk. Yeah. All right. And uh, you, it's funny, somebody come to me about a month ago, and there was a major, major accident at the corner of Brunswick and Westmoreland. Mm -hmm. and, uh, All right. and you took the pictures there. Yeah. And it was a bad accident. Yeah. <laughs> what? How, what are you doing smoking? Fuck that goddamn thing off there. Okay. <laughs> So, maybe you're under pressure. <laughs> so, uh, you know, you did, you, you were what we call a citizen journalist. It's you see something and you take pictures of. Yeah. And what happened this afternoon? I went to an accident scene at the corner of York and King Street, tried to take a picture. One of the fire fighters come over and said, don't be taking pictures of this accident, he said, because he said, I see you around all the time, trying to get pictures of accident scenes. And he said, if you continue to take pictures, I'll report you to the city police. Did, so, did the city police uh, go after you? No, he didn't tell him because I backed up. He said, just get your camera, he said, put it in your pocket and get out of here. Now, why would they say that? I know that Fredericton, I'm interviewing the chief tomorrow. Yeah. Okay. And they're pretty secret. They used to have an open scanner that you would know what's yeah. going on if there's yeah. a gas leak. And now they're pretty secret. Yeah. Why were the member of the Fredericton firefighters would tell you not to take pictures? I'm not sure. I know one time too, like, like you said, the Fredericton Fire Department used to have an app you could click on yeah. and hear what was going on. But yeah. now they don't even have that. No, they so don't. What are they hiding? Yes. Fire department. <laughs> so why, with social media, anyone can take pictures, anyone has a camera, anyone I call this a weapon, Yeah. <laughs> everybody has a video, so what's the big deal? I'm not sure. <laughs> so is that going to stop you from taking <laughs> pictures? Probably not, no, because I'm still going to try to get pictures of accident scenes, but... There's nothing wrong in taking pictures. No. I can understand, like me, when I took pictures, I, I remember there was a major accident between Brunswick, the corner of Brunswick and Westmoreland. Yeah. And some woman was there, oh, dare you take my pictures. I said, no problem. Yeah. Just don't drive, learn how to drive. Yeah. Don't have no accident around my area. No. Then there'll be no problem. We got no more police scanners. We don't know what's going on. No. So the first police are going after people that dare to take pictures. Yeah. Let me know if this happens again. Are you, is that going to stop you? No. Still going to try to get pictures. And he said, yeah, if you take a picture, he's where you plan on putting the picture. On your Facebook? Yeah. I was going to, but I didn't get a picture because he told me to leave, so. You're a journalist. Yeah. You've got your own Facebook. Yeah. A person has their own Twitter account. Blogging. Yeah. Everybody's a journalist these days. Yeah. You will have any more problems with the Ferdinand uh, Fireman. Fire department. I'll find out tomorrow what is. I can understand if a woman, I got in trouble a few times, the privacy issue of a woman yeah. slides on the, hits her head on the sidewalk. Yeah. But no, this is an accident and you see it all the time on CTV, on mainstream media of an accident. Yeah. So how come you can't do it? I'm not sure. Like I said, it goes all over the news anyway, so. <laughs> 
Don't stop. What no. you do. If you have any problem, come and see me. Yeah, okay, we'll do. Thank you. <laughs>